Hi everyone, it's Jack here at Main Skill. So you know the crack. If you haven't hit that subscribe button, make sure you do it. Ring the bell. Make sure you get the notifications. So, thanks for tuning in again. We're on the YouTube channel. That's what we like to keep trying to do. So, what we're on with today, if you haven't guessed already, is we are on with sheep. So, we're going to move them over to some other fields we've got. So, it's got hot now. Very hot. Stupid hot. So, it's very hot now. And it's starting to burn the grass up a bit. So, there's not a lot left around here. There's plenty about here and there. There's quite a lot on this field here. But... I don't want to eat all the grass up here with the sheep because the cows and calves are here and it's a bigger job moving cows and calves than it is moving a bunch of sheep. So we're going to move the sheep, take them to some other fields. So uh, where we're taking them, there's actually 48 beasts in there, young heifers that I bought out of Carlisle. So they're going to go into there. Uh, Ian's just gone down on the buggy to get them because he beat me here. So he's going to fetch them up with the buggy and his dogs. He's got his good dogs, the good them. Three of them I think he's got today. He does have nine though, he likes his dogs. Uh, We've got the cattle trailer behind. I'm going to be on that. Ian's going to be on the wagon once we've got them in here. But we're going to go through them. We've got them in here. Nice pen ready for them. Even got a water trough in the middle because it's a hot day for them. So we're going to get them in here, fetch them in, into here. And uh, we're going to put them through into the trailers and take them straight away. Uh, normally when we have sheep in, we put them through the foot bath. We're not going to do that today because it's that hot out here today. If they go through that foot bath with the formalin in, by the time we get them there, in them wagons and the cattle trailer, that formalin will be pretty nasty. It's nasty for us, never mind for the sheep, so that you don't want them getting it as well. So that's why we're not going to do it. So we're literally getting them in. If there is any with bad feet, of course, we're going to flick them over, check the feet, do that. But that's what we're doing now. So we're getting them in, get them in the wagons, get them in the trailer and take them to the other spot. Good, good. Here we go. He's got the sheep here now. So looking good, so there's ewes and lambs in here. Soon be time to be splitting the lambs off as well. And also we're going to be dipping the ewes. Uh, I think we're dipping the ewes on the 29th of July. So that's when we'll be dipping. So that's to do as well, but they're looking good. Uh, we've pulled lambs out of here a few times now. So they thinned the lambs out a bit. But looking good. Maybe only has two dogs today actually. One, two. Looks like we're missing one today. Well, he switches between the others like, but he normally has these two all the time. But they're looking good. So nice shapey lambs, these Texels. And there's not that many there in that group, to be honest. They should soon shift these. We'll get the wagon and the cattle trailer going and they'll soon move. And that'll be grand. It'll free these fields up a bit. Come on, girls. That's it. Move up. There we go. They're not bad trains. They used to go in the race. Come on, girls. Good dogs. Still got the gator. We had a video about that when it first came in the snow, so you can have a look at that as well. Forgot about that one. It's done some work since it come. Just right. I'm sorry. So we're here now, as you can see, we're here with the girls. We've got the sheep here, ewes and lambs. Uh, there's the beast that I told you over there in front of that tree. They're the ones that I said are already here. So there's 48 in here, they're out of Carlisle, like I said. Ian's here with the wagon as well. So I'll let them go, and then I'll let these go. So here they are, so it's warm today, so we're not, put, we're not packed them in very tight. Because it's warm, so we don't want them too thick on. But 
I need to get a move today because I've got other jobs to do as well so that's why we're just cracking on with them ah, there they go Good girls, what's them ones? We'll shut back up. So there is a video on YouTube somewhere, it's one of my older ones. And it was when we moved these when they were little, so if you be able to see that one, it says something, I don't know, something like hundreds of young lambs or something, hundreds of little lambs. If you see that one you'll be able to see how much they've actually grown now and the biggest ones have already gone so you won't be able to see the biggest ones but it shows how much they have altered so here we go next ones here's ian big time trucker where's my yorkie bar yorkie bar yeah no. they're just for men then <laughs> 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 Come on girls, here we go. Next ones. Come on ladies. Hey up. That's the first ones, we'll go and get some more. Good, good. So here we are, just come back with the next two loads. And uh, yeah, the beast have come to see what's occurring. So here they are, as you can see, they're a mixture. So there's limmies, blues, uh, I don't know if there is any Charolais here actually. Uh, limmies, blues. So the red ones and the black ones are limmies. There could be a couple of Anguses which are also black mixed in here. There is actually right on the edge there. I've got one short on there. But that's a look at them. We'll pull in now. Ian's pulling in behind. So we'll let these off as well. There we go. CA66 there, right next to that. Good farm shop on there, a bit further up. Come on girls, time to shine, you're on camera, go girls, go girls, there you go then. So yeah, all Texels and Texel crosses are used. And then all the lambs off these are used in our farm shop. That good farm shop I said about up the road. Should we see if these beasts will stand here for us? So yeah, like I said, limmies, red limmies, black limmies. Uh, there's my short one, that red and black, uh, red and white one. It's a Charolais, that yellowy one. And there's a white blue, another white blue, and there is a speckledy blue, actual blue one here somewhere. There they go, they seem happy. Plenty of grass on here, 25 acre field. Um, and yeah, look like they're happy. We'll carry on. So nearly gone boss now, there's not many left as you can see. Should soon shift these last few. Getting pushed up ready now, he's gonna back up. Between my legs. A 
feet. Go on, you go in there. I'm ready for next floor. This is it now. Last one, so the last two load of the day. So here they go. So you see him coming off there now. So that's the last ones I've got. And then Ian's got his last ones on the wagon over there. That'll be them all done then. He's just about to let them go. As you can see, they've all spread out across the field now. They're just shouting a bit because the lambs and ewes will all be mixed up, but they'll sort themselves out now. They'll find all the mates and sort them and get gathered together. But that's them sorted. So just a race to pack up now and take home and job done. Good, good.